In danger on duty for a Florida Highway Patrol trooper when a man walks up to his car and starts shooting. This happened yesterday afternoon in Northeast Miami-Dade. CBS 4's Peter Dench is live in Doral where he just spoke with the president of the Police Benevolent Association. Peter? Well, Maribel, we can tell you that a lot of police officers I've been speaking with are truly troubled by this latest shooting. FHP says for no apparent reason, the gunman walked up to a trooper who was sitting in his car and opened fire. Now, as you mentioned, I just spoke with the head of the South Florida PBA. He tells me he's alarmed. South Florida PBA President Stedman Stahl is horrified by this latest incident in which someone in law enforcement was shot at. Uh, it's pure evil. It's pure evil out there that you have a, uh, a state trooper that's doing his job, sitting in his car, and this animal comes up and starts shooting into his car for no reason at all. We're lucky that that, that state trooper is still alive right now. And uh, I don't believe that bad guy will be pointing guns at police, anybody else anytime soon. Fortunately, the FHP trooper escaped the hail of bullets and was able to return fire, wounding the suspect who was taken to Aventura Hospital. Cell phone video obtained by CBS4 shows that suspect lying on the ground. It happened Wednesday afternoon at Northeast 186th Street and West Dixie Highway. FHP says the trooper was guarding a lane closure for a roadway project when a man in a white Nissan stopped, got out, walked up to the trooper and opened fire. FHP says the gunman was unprovoked. Well, there's shootings going on everywhere right now, but this anti-police rhetoric that we've seen last year, I think it's spilling over, and I was hoping to see a decrease in it, but we're not. And it's very concerning to see, you know, our FBI agents, our, our, our police officers just being shot for no reason at all. The trooper's car was riddled with bullets. It happened just one day after two FBI agents, Daniel Alfin and Laura Schwarzenberger, were shot and killed, and three other FBI agents wounded while serving a warrant in a child porn case in Sunrise. Our hearts and prayers go out to the families of those two FBI agents, uh, but it just shows you that you never know when evil will, will show its face. How that trooper didn't get hit was certainly a St. Michael's. It was an angel looking out for him. Now, FHP and the Miami-Dade State Attorney's Office are both investi investigating, as is the Florida Department of Law Enforcement, which is standard procedure as there's such police-involved shootings. The FHP trooper has not been identified. He's on non-disciplinary administrative leave, which is also standard procedure after such incidents. We're live in Doral, Peter Dench, CBS 4 News. Maribel.